Good evening, good evening, good evening, my friends. Today, today I'm going to share something that I was thinking about today, and it just dawned on me all of a sudden as I was listening to this worship music. And uh, anyways, I'm just going to read Acts chapter 5, and I'm not, you know, I'm just focusing on this one phrase. Um, I'm not really going into the context of this passage. But it says, The God of our fathers raised up Jesus, whom you slew and hanged on a tree. And honestly, I never thought about this before. And I don't know why it just hit me today. But it, it's funny how like that is with God. You know, and it's like... Um, you could read something a hundred times or hear something a hundred times, but then all of a sudden, one time, it's like the Lord is just opening your mind to something new. And and the thing the Lord was showing me today is, is you know, Jesus was hanged on a tree. You know, he was hung on a tree. And I know that, it, you know, we talk about how he, anyone that was hung on a tree, you know, was accursed and Jesus became a curse for us. But but what I never considered before was that, you know, what what is what is the ir irony here? You know, um, our salvation came through Christ's crucifixion <clears throat> on a tree. But what was it that He was saving us from? He was saving us from the death that we entered into because of the fruit which Eve ate from a tree. You know what I'm saying? Like I like death entered into the world because of a tree. You know what I mean? So God is so awesome and, and he brought life to us through a tree as well. You know what I mean? And I don't really have much more to say about that, but I just thought that that was really cool. And I never thought about that before. So sin entered into the world uh, by a tree. And life entered into the world through a tree. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, so the tree, the tree is, uh, is where it's at today. For your, to, to something to think about. And if anybody can give me any further understanding into this, I am open uh, to it, but I haven't really um, received much more than that besides the, man, just how awesome God is, you know, and those little details uh, of what he's done, and, uh, you know, just nothing's wasted, nothing, you know, there's nothing to be overlooked, but God is awesome, amen.